So today I'm with Explorer with Kerry. We're just looking at a house in uh, on the edge of West Yorkshire, going on towards uh, Manchester. Yeah, it's quite a nice place. You can see it's quite overgrown. Nice bungalow though, plenty to see inside. And we'll take you around the inside now. So we are now inside the bungalow. We believe this would have been used by the head gardener of Robert Ashton Memorial Park. So he would have been based here and looked after all the grounds for the park. And you can see the inside is still in fairly decent condition. Now I'll take you straight to the main audio. Welcome back, it's UK Evics, and today we're in an old, it's a park house in Melfort. So this was originally for the park owner. So, well, the, so the head gardener would have stayed in here, lived in here. So we looked at letters and stuff, and it looks like the last time it was actually in use was 2018. You can see this looks really dated, but then you go to a part of the house and it looks more modern, but the back just show you the kitchen here, there's a leak, so it's a couple of wire feeds being in again. Unfortunately, the stop tap's been broken. You can see it's been pulled off, so I can't turn it off. I mean, I could probably look for a pair of pliers in my car, and maybe try and come back in and look at that, but there we go. So I'll take you down the corridor here. You see, look, it, look, it has got like an old people's vibe to it. Again, it's the same in here. This is like, I think this would have been a bedroom. It looks like it's only two bedroom place. But yeah, it's not, this is an old curtain there. There we go. That would have been the wardrobe there. So it's only a small explorer to say. Uh, let me show you around. Up to the loft there. There we go. And the bathroom, see, looks really modern. So it's like they have stuck to replace bits of it. So yeah, this is a place where I mean, we often have looked at, we've, we've gone past here a few times and think, oh, we'd like to live here. I wonder what it's like inside, and now I finally managed to get inside. So. It'd be interesting to show the footage of what it's like in here. But there you go, the bathroom is very modern, I say. I do like it. I'm just say, the place was up for sale. Somewhere, I mean, my girlfriend would quite happy to call home. It's got a nice lounge room here. Although, this would be probably the back bedroom we'd use it as. Usually, we'll use the lounge room. Then we have a spare room or an Airbus room here. And it's got a fireplace in it. So I'm presuming these are the two bedrooms. But yeah, it's a very little explorer to say, but yeah, very old. I'll just show you around the corridor once more. You see that's the old phone box, radiator connected there. That's a nice hallway. That's a decent smart detector. See, that looks new as well. Weird. And then the old thermostat there. Look at that, you don't see many of them anymore like that. You don't see many more like that. And there's the lounge room. The last bits. Fireplace in. If you start taking some photos now, do you need my light to? Hey, I've got some pretty. There you go, that's about it for the Explore guys. Please remember to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and we will see you in the next one. Peace out.